What's up everyone? Welcome to Hey Obi. In today's video, I will be walking you through how to take a train in China in just five easy steps. If this sounds like something that you're interested in, then keep watching. When you arrive at the train station, the first question you need to ask yourself is, do I have a ticket? If you do not have a ticket, then you need to find the ticket office. Buying a ticket at the train station is not the only way to obtain a ticket, but I find that it is the most straightforward route to go um, in order to avoid other booking fees. But if you don't mind a few booking fees, then definitely you can go online. I will leave some places where you can buy tickets online down in the description box. Congrats on finding the ticket office. So once you find the ticket office, you want to hop online. At this time, you want to make sure that you have your passport handy, have the information written. On this paper, you will have the date, the train number, the times of the train and where you want to go. Once that transaction is done, you want to just step over to the side and check the ticket. Make sure that you have all of your documents as well as the ticket being at least shoot for 90 to 100% accurate. It doesn't have to be completely perfect in terms of your name and everything, but make sure that where you are going is correct as well as the time is correct as well as your passport number is correct. Those three things are a must. If you check your ticket and everything looks good, then you can move on to security. So, at this point, this is where they would check your documents as well as the ticket and make sure that you are on track to get onto the right train. Once you pass security, you want to look for a big screen. This screen will let you know what trains are leaving from what waiting rooms. Once you know where to go, head over to the waiting room and when you get to the waiting room that you think is your waiting room, there is another opportunity for you to just double check above the doorway you will see a board similar to the one that you saw downstairs you can look on there to see if your train number is on that board if it is not on that board then you have the wrong waiting room and you can go back and try again once you get to the waiting room if you have some time which you should always make sure that you do you never want to just be cutting it super close but if you have some time, you can totally chill out in the waiting room, um, make yourself comfortable, but always keep an eye on the time and make sure that you are just being aware of your surroundings. You know it's time to board your train when you see a bunch of Chinese people congregating as well as your train number on a board in the very front of the room has something in green characters next to it. Follow the signage that has your train number on it and definitely you will get down to the platform. So once you find your way down to the platform, then you want to look at your ticket again. Look at the train carriage that you're in and from there you can walk down until you will find your carriage number. There will be a conductor outside and the conductor will check your ticket. If you are at the wrong carriage number then the conductor will point you in the direction that you need to go now there's nothing left to do but sit back and enjoy your ride and remember to get off at the correct stop that's definitely a must 
So if you enjoyed this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Remember to comment and subscribe as well. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.